Yo, 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 it's your boy OG Shizzy Brizzle. This is another Shizzy Lit Podcast. She understands me. Uh, Kearns and shit. <clears throat> but I've been looking at this little video and shit. Just, you know, surfing through YouTube and shit as I do. I blow my stouts and shit. Hit the family. Say what's going on and shit. You know. I'm looking at this joint Terrell Owens and shit. You know. I mean. He's still rich. He got some money. I ain't saying he the richest, but you know he live in the little R neighborhood and shit. You know a Kern. They got whole videos on Kerns and shit. These little snobby white chicks feel the sense of entitlement and shit and think they can just tell black motherfuckers what to do. I believe they think they can tell any motherfucker buyer what to do. Shit, you know, feel me, so you know what I mean. I was looking at this damn video. She harassing the shit out my man and shit like on some like you know, why are you fucking with me if you so scared of a black man and shit you the feel me she talking about my man was speeding she lying and shit talking about my man running stop signs that wasn't there what's what? I'm like what street we your probably was looking like fuck street we or the fuck you see a stop sign that so you the feel me her credibility was shot you the feel me you know what I mean at the beginning of the video she cussing my man out and all this type shit you the feel me then you know. She just got so frustrated and mad, she just let the cat out the bag and shit. And just was like, yeah, because you're a big black man talk, talking to a white woman. All right, bitch. Like, uh, you ain't uh, you ain't worrying about the motherfucking combination, bitch. Because, of uh, you approach me. You ain't too scared. How the fuck is you scared, right? But you're coming forward towards me aggressively. Last time I was scared of that motherfucker, I ain't want to go to it. Bitch, you like, you feel me? If you scared of somebody... You gonna be doing the opposite of what the fuck the lady was doing. She not, you not gonna be coming full with talking shit. Your husband telling you, now the whole time the husband was dead. He can't control the bitch. See, this is the shit that I be talking about. He can't control the chick and shit. <clears throat> she going crazy. Now, what if yo would have smacked him? Like, all right, I ain't going to beat your wife up because she a chick. But yo, you can't check your chick, yo. I might smack you. See, that's the problem. That's, that'd be problems with everything. But the currency, they feel more entitled like they just can use. You know what I mean? We call it weaponizing shit. You know what I mean? Weaponizing on the racist tip and shit. Because she a, a little snobby white lady. The police around and shit. Now she wanna play victim and shit. Yeah, he a big black guy and you know, bitch, you know exactly who I am, they know exactly who I am. You come over here fucking with me. Everybody done seen it. Husband try to stop you. He ain't shit. He can't do shit. You the feel me? I'm cussing you the fuck out. Then my man go live. So we the, the whole thing is on motherfucking camera shit. The whole drone is on live. This bitch stuck. Listen, yo, now I done seen videos and this shit be embarrassing me. Like, I be embarrassed for these motherfuckers because when they don't get their way and the first little level of motherfucking currentism don't work, which is the line and shit and try to get a nigga locked up or some shit because we black and shit. You think you can just call the police lie because you're a white lady and you the feel me? They going to believe. And that's nine times out of ten this going to happen. You the feel me? Like, my man went live, shut all that shit down, and he had a motherfucking um, <clears throat> an eyewitness that shut her straight down. Like, that bitch straight lied. Simple as that shit line. Boop, bop, biggity, bing, bop. Police whole time still acting like they riding with the little current bitches. See, see, this the shit I'm talking about, and that's why they do it. Like, they don't shut the bullshit down. They let the bullshit ride and shit. So, he telling, he telling you he ain't do shit. The shit she saying is lying. The shit she saying sound like a lie. She done proved that she lied because she said he ran the stop sign and there wasn't no stop sign credibility shot with a motherfucking 12 gig. You the feel me? You still treat me. See, this the bullshit. Now, if he ain't had a camera on, bro, you the feel me? It would have been a whole situation. Yo saved himself. And I don't know if he knew that at the time. He definitely saved himself. Because they was definitely going to be on the bullshit. They was already on borderline bullshit on the motherfucking camera and shit. You the feel me? They telling him to calm down because the motherfucker accused him. Like, yo, tell her to calm the fuck down. First of all, why is she over here? She crying, she crying and claiming scared and victim and shit. Why is she over here though? Like these are the simple questions that need to be asked. And if you can ask them and be a bean with, you need to be leaning on her. Like yo, take your goofy ass back to the crib. Fuck are you over here messing with the ball for, bitch? I wish you would try to play that. You scared? How the fuck are you scared? I'd have locked that dumb ass up for wasting my motherfucking time. And now that I'm thinking about it, I I went through a current moment. I went through a current moment, man. You the feel me? Did ass like. 
I was at my door the little softball game and shit. And I guess that's like a motherfucking a damn hangout spot for currents and shit, boy. You know what I'm saying? I, I, little spots like that, boy. Little soccer games, little softball games and shit, little volleyball games. You know feel me? Shit like that. It be the turns, boy, like did that. Hey, it the feel me? Like, nigga had some sparkles. We ain't had no firecrackers. We had no, we had, we in the parking lot of the fucking softball field chilling. I'm at my car, parked next to it. We lighting sparkles. Not no fireworks, nothing that make no noise except the little crackle sound. Sparkles. Y'all know what sparkles The shit you light and hold and just twirl around and they sparkle that. This bitch like a quarter mile away talking about don't like that shit by my car. So instantly I'm on our top. Who the fuck is you talking to like that? You better learn how to talk to somebody. So the little bitch, see, this is what I'm saying. So the little motherfuckers want to be so tough. So these white bitches can't sit right there and use that they scared of black men and shit. Me and my son, she walks up tough as shit, talking shit. So I had to put it in a motherfucking place in front of everybody. You know, feel me? And here come another motherfucker the whole time. This bitch don't even know what's going on. She see a little white bitch going off. I start cussing the bitch out because I'm the best that ever did it, bitch. You, you definitely not winning. You know, feel me? Because I ain't doing shit wrong, so you definitely not ready just bitch me out and like make me like fuck that police be here and all that shit. We can go all the way there if that's what they gotta do. You know, feel me? All I know is. Little bitch got a little bit too motherfucking close And I start cussing that bitch out Like, bitch, first of all You need to go here about your business You keep getting motherfucking close Like I won't smack fire out your little ass Yes, I will Please believe that shit If you get too close and you make me uncomfortable I'ma smack fire out You won't get me locked up any motherfucking way So I might as well motherfucking You know what I mean? Go hard and catch a charge for real, bitch Because if you, I'ma kill you if you get me locked up for nothing So I'ma help you out Slap the skin off your skull, bitch you know, feel me? Pardon me, cause I don't promote that shit, but I ain't gonna lie. Little shit, just little petty shit like that, boy. Yes, sir. Have a nigga on this Ike Turner shit out there. Pardon me, cause you know that ain't even my motherfucking sis now. But anyway, back to the story and shit. Boom. Little bitch doing all this yap yap yap. I got you a little bitch. You talking all that crazy shit. I know you better not touch me. You better not touch my motherfucking kid. And you better go here about your motherfucking business. Here come another little white chick talking about, hold on, blah, blah, blah. I don't even know what the fuck going on. Oh. She's talking about that. Like, he lighting firecrackers. She's like, I heard a bitch ain't here nothing. We had sparkles. We had firecrackers. You lie. Shut her down. Had her looking stupid. You know, feel me? Her, her bobbling her words and shit. Walking back looking dumb and shit. You know, feel me? I don't know who the fuck they thought they was fucking with, shorty. Kid, I don't give a fuck with me yet. You ain't gonna disrespect me. Bitch, there's a ways to say shit. You know, feel me? Ain't nobody worrying about your little Camry or whatever the fuck you had. Bitch, you ain't had no Lexus Benz or nothing for you to be worrying about somebody lighting a sparkle by and shit. Like, bitch, if you don't miss me with all the best boy shit you ever tried to muster up in your life, you did it with the right motherfucking one. She wants speed off all quick. If one of them little pebbles or rocks or anything would have hit anybody with me or my car, I'd have bust every motherfucking window out that bitch, flatten every motherfucking tire, pissed in her shit, and waited for the motherfucking police to come. Fuck as you talk about, like, please don't let me go there. Like, do not press the button, because it ain't no turn off switch. It's dead ass until I'm in the cell, raising hell. Like, so, yeah. Yeah, I see that bitch kept it the fuck moving. That's all the fuck I know. So yeah, before I knew what it was called, I had a current you to feel me moment. I'ma pull double M Sam up about that and let him tell us a little end of the story. You to feel me and let him uh, vouch and verify the shit that I let you that I told y'all. Let y'all know it ain't the motherfucking game. Only thing I did, you know, I gotta make the story a little spicy. I ain't tell her I was gonna smack the skin off her skull, but my brain was saying. I was just calling her all kinds of bitches to get the fuck up out of here and all this type shit. You know, feel me? Because, you know, I could have called one of my goonettes up there. They'd have stop up there extra quick. They only come quick for the bullshit. So it's your boy, OG Shizzy Brizzle. I just wanted to talk to you about that shit. Y'all know I'm going to let y'all hear that T.O. situation. Y'all thought I was going to let that shit slide because that threw my little story in there. <laughs> I know. Here we go. It's your boy, OG S. Shizzy Mo. Motherfucker.